हेलो फ्रेंड्स वेलकम बैक आर टूडेज टॉपिक इज मैंसुरेशन एज यू नो मैंसुरेशन इज वन ऑफ द वेरी इंपॉर्टेंट टॉपिक फॉर ऑल काइंड ऑफ कॉम्पिटेटिव एग्जाम्स रिलेटेड बी बैंक एस एस सी रेलवे यू पी एस सी सैट एंड प्लेसमेंट ट्रेनिंग फ्रेंड्स इन ऑल द एग्जाम्स यू कैन फाइंड क्वेश्चन फ्रॉम द मैंसुरेशन एंड फ्रेंड्स इफ यू टॉक अबाउट द पर्टिकुलरली आर आर बी एंड द एस एस सी एग्जाम देन द क्वेश्चन फ्रॉम द मैंसुरेशन विल बी मिनिमम फाइव सो मैंसुरेशन प्लेस अ वेरी इंपॉर्टेंट रोल इन द सेंट्रल गवर्नमेंट exams friends so let's start with the question number 1 and try to solve which is based on the circles so the ratio of circumferences of two circle is 2 is to 3 now friends if we'll talk about the circle if we'll talk about the circle then this will be your radius right okay and if we'll talk about the circumference and if we'll talk about the circumference then circumference will be circumference will be equal to 2 pi r okay circumference will be equal to 2 pi r so what is the ratio of their area so you have to find out the ratio of their area so friends circumferences so friends circumferences you can see the ratio is given 2 is to 3 so c1 by c2 is equals to 2 by 3 okay now so friends circumference will be equal to 2 pi here r1 and 2 pi here r2 will be equal to 2 by 3 now friends 2 pi and 2 pi will get cancelled so we got the radius of radius of both the circles see there is two circles are there the two circles are there and then the circumferences ratio is nothing but 2 is to 3 so here we got the radius ratio is 2 by 3 now friends they are asking what is the ratio of their area so ratio ratio of areas ratio of areas so a1 divided by a2 will be equal to friends pi r1 square so suppose this radius is r1 this radius is r2 and here pi r2 square now friends pi so here only you can see friends from here you can see if you will calculate if you will make a square of both so if you will make a square of both here then so square on both the sides so this will become 4 by 9 so r1 square divided by r2 square will be equal to 4 by 9 okay friends now so if you will multiply and divide by pi so if you will multiply and divide by pi friends this will become area so a1 by a2 is equals to 4 by 9 so friends if they are asking you to calculate the ratio of the area then it will be 4 by 9 so a1 is to a2 will be equal to 4 by 9 and that will be the correct answer for the question number 1 friends so here you can directly write 4 by 9 so circumference ratio were given from there we calculated the radius friends from there we calculated the ratio of the radius and once we calculated the ratio of the radius we made a square on both side so a squaring a squaring both side so we made a square on both the side a squaring both the side and then friends we calculated the ratio of the area will be nothing but 4 is to 9 and that is the correct answer for the question number 1 now moving towards question number 2 friends now friends the question is a circular wire of diameter so a circular wire is there of diameter 42 cm so circular wire let okay write it like this so a circular wire of diameter 42 cm is bent in the form of a is bent in the form of a is bent in the form of a rectangle okay so circular wire friends you can write like this also a circular wire okay of diameter of diameter 42 cm so if diameter is 42 cm friends then the radius will become diameter by 2 so 42 by 2 will be 21 cm so friends the radius of the the radius of the circular wire the radius of the circular wire will become 21 cm because diameter is given 42 cm so friends this circular wire is bent into a form of a rectangle whose sides are in the ratio of 6 is to 5 okay friends now so friends if a circular wire if you are converting in terms of rectangle what will be same friends length will be same length will be same right friends length will be same if you are circular wire if you are converting into the rectangular wire so length will be same friends and if length is same that means perimeter is same that means perimeter is same okay friends now let's calculate let's calculate the perimeter of rectangle or the circumference of uh, sorry circumference of circumference of circle right circumference of circle or perimeter of circle because perimeter of because perimeter of circle 
will be equal to the perimeter of rectangle why friends because the length of the wire because the length of the wire will not change so if you are converting a circular wire into a rectangular wire then the length of the wire will not change now friends perimeter of circle will be 2 pi r and here perimeter of rectangle will be 2 into length plus breadth okay friends now so here length and breadth is given in terms of ratio so you convert in terms of value so length will become 6x and breadth will become 5x now 2 into 22 by 7 radius is 21 is equals to 2 into so l plus b 6 plus 5 will be 11 x friends now 7 3 is a 11 into 2 is 20 so x will become 6 friend x will become 6 friends now area will become equal to length into breadth find the area of the rectangle so length is 6x and breadth is 5x 6 into 5 is 30x square now friends 30 into x square will become 36 so 36 into 3 is 108 so 1080 uh, centimeter square will be the area of rectangle so your answer will be 1080 centimeter square so friends this was a very good question so our today's session was a very important session so you have to understand how we have solved the question here so the perimeter the lens will not change if you convert a circular wire into a rectangular wire so friends thanks a lot for watching the video